Do an early Christmas gift in the sky tonight. Jupiter and Saturn coming close together, forming the so-called Christmas star. Pretty neat. CBS 13's Valina Jones is live for us in Newcastle tonight, where dozens of people gather to see this rare sight. Valina. That that's right. You know, it's been almost 800 years since the two planets aligned at night, giving us a chance to see them this close together. The history making event had people camped out all along this road looking to the sky. I was actually about to cry. Oh, it was beautiful. I'm glad we got to see it and be a part of history. It's a Christmas treat for many tonight who are watching history take place right before their eyes. Tonight is a special night for us because we'll never get to see it again. Cars line the side of Indian Hill Road waiting to get a peek of the two largest planets, Jupiter and Saturn coming so close to one another. It is creating a bright big star. Right before the uh, clouds moved in, we got to see it, so that was really exciting. It's called the Great Conjunction. Cloud covered the view for some of the Sacramento region, while others stood in wonder. Saturn and Jupiter come near to one another in the sky once every 20 years. But this year is actually very special. It's very rare for them to get as close as they're going to get this year. The last time you could see both planets align as bright as tonight was back in 1226. Despite the view from Earth, Dr. Kyle Waters says the planets aren't as close as they seem. This is very much an optical illusion. You look at it and you're like, oh my gosh, Saturn's going to crash into Jupiter. No, they are millions and millions and millions of miles apart. The two planets are being called the Christmas star. And I just think it's a fantastic way to celebrate Christmas mm -hmm. by seeing the Christmas star. Some comparing it to the star of Bethlehem, which is thought to be a conjunction of the two planets, like tonight. Well, I'm hoping that maybe this is a sign that 2020 is almost over and that 2021 is going to be a great year. Now, another special point tonight. Tonight is winter solstice, the darkest day of the year. And if you miss that Christmas star, there's still a couple of chances to see it. Those two planets will be close together for the next couple of days. And while it won't be as bright, you will still have a couple of chances to catch a glimpse.